Good day. Welcome to another episode of Masonic Curators. I am joining here again today with Right Worshipful David Vogel, the presiding district deputy grandmaster of the second Masonic district. He is going to present the master's copy. Now you may have <clears throat> remembered that a couple of episodes ago at Clinton, both Right Worshipful Leonard and I spoke about the master's copy from 1784 that they have in their building. A number of these pieces have survived. A number of these pieces are still in Masonic buildings. This piece here, from time to time, is still used or referenced to uh, when the master is doing a specific uh, work on a degree. Some of them have ended up in private hands. Others, uh, such as the Scottish Rite Masonic Museum in Lexington, has a number of them in their collection and have done beautiful jobs on preserving them. Uh, as I had mentioned earlier, with Clinton, it's primarily called a master's carpet because it is placed here in the East, or was in the early days, as a carpet laid on the floor, and the candidate would stand in front of it, and the master would then explain those emblems that are on it. Uh, this is a beautiful piece. Uh, we are very, very proud to have it here in Cambridge, and now I'll turn it over to Right Worshipful David to explain a little bit about it. The oil painting behind me, hanging in the east of Endicott Hall in the Cambridge Masonic Temple, uh, we believe dates to around the 1820s. As we've been unable to obtain any records of this painting, we cannot know for certain who painted it, when it was painted, when it was purchased, or when it was donated. Several years ago, the curator of the Cambridge Masonic Temple consulted with the director of collections at the Scottish Rite Museum in Lexington, Massachusetts, and they concluded that the painting was most likely the work of Jonas Prentice. Uh, Prentice, Brother Prentice was a mason uh, who was a member of Hiram Lodge, which met in Lexington, Massachusetts. Hiram Lodge was founded in 1797. Prentice was a resident of West Cambridge and a carriage painter by trade. Given the quality and detail of carriage painting at that time, it is likely that he regularly practiced the skills which would have been necessary to produce such a painting. There is a confirmed master's carpet painted by Prentice, which is in the collection of the Scottish Rite Museum in Lexington. There are a great many details which are very similar to his work, as well as others that differ and items that appear to have been added subsequent to the initial painting. So it is likely that either he began the painting and it had to be completed by someone else, or details were later added or rearranged by another person at another. Master's carpets were used in much the same way we use PowerPoints today, to illustrate and distill details of Masonic ritual or degree lectures. They were later replaced in many cases by Masonic charts. Many of these pieces of art were later framed and hung in lodge rooms and put on display in Masonic temples, Masonic buildings, and apartments throughout the country. A number of these pieces of art are still owned and still displayed in Masonic buildings throughout the state. 